Now, the once flourishing sport of NASCAR has struggled in recent years, hurt by the effects of the recession. But there is hope on the horizon, in part from a 12-year-old driver who aspires to be the best ever. And that is the focus of tonight's Weekend Journal, striving for excellence at a very young age. He started 11th, came to 4th. Gray Golding is nothing if not focused. People say you have friends on the racetrack, but when you put your helmet on, you're strapped in, there is no friends. This is coming from a 12-year-old. A 12-year-old with his own racetrack in the backyard, his own table at a local restaurant, his own sandwich, and his own racing team. So the first lap, I just pulled it in. Oh, and one very supportive family. We moved from Virginia to here just for my racing career. The Goldings picked up and moved from Virginia to North Carolina in 2008, just so Gray could be closer to the Charlotte Motor Speedway. Does this feel like home to you, being on the racetrack? Oh, yeah, any racetrack is really home for me. You know, it's, a, it's like a bee in a beehive. He began racing motorbikes at age three. I start way back on my heat. And is now the youngest driver in racing's legends division, racking up 10 wins in 30 starts, winning $20,000 this year alone as he speeds down the track at 130 miles an hour. Gray has his sights set on one day, topping the record seven overall NASCAR championships won by Dale Earnhardt, or the four straight won more recently by Jimmy Johnson. At what age do you think you can win four in a row by? Oh, uh, you know, really, I don't know, but uh, I just got to thank my sponsor, GunBroker.com. Really That's right, GunBroker.com, an internet seller of handguns, which Gray mentions often. When some people hear that he's sponsored by GunBroker.com, well, they say, uh, you know, I get that a lot. There ain't no other sponsors come along yet that I feel comfortable with. Gray's father, Dwayne, negotiates Gray's sponsorships and manages his media training. Well, when I ride down the road, I interview my son. And uh, we'll we just, we just be riding down the road. We'll just be riding down the road, and I'll say, So tell me how your car was, Gray. Right? And he'll practice the answers. Like then. We might be on TV this Saturday. Some people say that I have too much camera, but there's never too much of the camera because you never know who's watching. Dwayne Golding bristles at the notion he pushes his son too hard. He calls Gray highly self-motivated, with self-imposed daily runs, even a racing simulator in his bedroom. Some people choose, you know, to play sports and, you know, go to camps on days like that, but I choose to go race and 